How we doing, folks? It is your boy, Marco. So get it off here with some Manic Monday Part 2 brought to you by Velocity. I just wanted me to play some league play, see what I ranked up, see what I did. Uh, yeah, I was in the 70s after after these placement games. I was in the 70s and like the gold division in both and like the team and like in the uh, in the individual. I, I was kind of around the same area. Uh, don't know if that's good or bad. Didn't even look it up. Don't really care. Uh, Brian made it to the Masters division, so I guess that's really good for him. Uh, I didn't keep playing after that. I wasn't too too interested. Um, we're on slums right here. I toned down the kill streaks a lot because we're not getting any more loads. So I was like, come on, man, that was an aberration. Uh, this is definitely my favorite part though, uh, or my favorite uh, game mode in the uh, in the league play is the hard point. Uh, and I played a lot of hard point, like a lot. Of, and I I don't know if there's maybe somebody can answer this question for me, uh, educate me a little bit on this. Um, I don't know if there's only certain maps because I played slums, raid, standoff. A lot that throughout my league play experience. I was trying to get other matches. That's like what I mainly played, and I mainly played hardpoint over like any other game mode. I think I played like in like ten games that I played. I probably played seven hard points. That one capture the flag you saw, and like two, uh, like two search and destroys. Hopefully that adds up to ten, because y'all know me, man. Math ain't my forte. I don't give a damn about mathematics, bro. I don't get paid to be crunching out numbers like that. I got paid to hit buttons. All right, so we managed to pop this guy right here. Speaking of which, man, I'm still recovering, man. From Wimbledon this past week when I worked at, man. Whoo, talk about boring. And talk about throwing a bad health somewhere here. I die while using it. Uh, managed to get two right there with the rest of them in the bar, and I cough up the hard point. If you want a 101 on how not to use a, uh, a health storm missile in the game, that's it right there. Don't do that. Uh, one thing that, that really interests me about League Play was a four-on-four four aspect. And I guess it's because, you know, it's easy to find four of your friends rather than six of your friends to play with. Uh, I'm used to the big lobby. I'm used to the six-man lobby, and I like it. I, I like that number. So, to me, the four-on-four four took a little bit getting used to. Uh, kind of like when I play multi-team, you just don't run into that many people. Every gunfight counts a lot more. That's something I very enjoyed about. Uh, enjoyed a lot about this. It's kind of, you know, type Tuesday-ish in that sense. Every gunfight just counts that much more. You lose a gunfight, you're like, damn, especially if it's a search and destroy, where that means you're basically sitting on the sideline. Or um, if it's... Um, what should we call it with the other the, the game? Oh, Capture the Flag, where you got to, like, wait 10 seconds out. And there's my man right there, Captain the Hard Point. You can't even be mad at those people, man. Sitting in the corners and the hard points. That's what you got to do, man. You got to cap those flags. And that's, you know, one thing that even though I didn't play it, I didn't enjoy it because of the people sitting in the corners, I completely understood it. I have no problem with that, man. I, you know, I have a qualm with, you know, I, put, I think I mentioned in the, in the Rush video I did um, when, I, when I did the, the video reviewing that map. I have a problem with people who get, like, the new maps and just go and sit in corners. Like, that's like, what are you doing, son? Like, you paid... 20 or 15 or whatever amount of dollars and he's gonna sit in the corner like what are you doing you sit in the corner here in league play trying to cap a hard point man you're just trying to win dude i don't give a damn what you do to win do anything that you can to win it doesn't matter it's all about winning getting that w do whatever you can you you there's no rules for that and turn right here man just see my man he leaves the name there i'm like oh come on i'm hurt i'm pushing up right here i mainly in this game i let my team do the hard point capping uh occasionally i'll slip in there i'll always come in and out and back but i knew that you know there's four guys on the team and I knew um, this is a good map for me to get those kills. So I knew I'd be able to, you know, push up and do some damage up there and hopefully get some good kills. Uh, so that was mainly my my thinking in this game over here. Uh, you know, when you look at these professionals, look at that. How unfortunate is that? I jumped right in front of the dude. Oh, man. Uh, when you look at these professional guys, man, I mean, they got strategies. There's people anchoring. There's people, I mean, they, they got vocabulary for, like, what they do right here. And there's, there's instructional videos on how to do that. Kudos to them, man. It's a completely different game, honestly. It's, it's, it, it, it's under the same umbrella of Call of Duty Black Ops 2. It's called the same game, but it's 100% different. There's none of that going on in my mind. In my mind, I'm like, all right, yo, y'all stay over here. I'm going to go kill these guys. That's that's my strategy right here. That's basically what, what, what we worked out over here with the team. And my man is flying over here in the middle of the map. Managed to get to his next hard point. I wanted to get up here to set up that sentry gun, but we couldn't do it, which is all right. Um... But yeah, I mean, if you're interested in that kind of stuff, man, I would definitely suggest watching some of those, like, pros when they play. Uh, watching some of their strategies over there and watch, like, just YouTube, man. YouTube, like, Call of Duty, like, I don't even know, uh, league play strategies and stuff. You'll be amazed at, like, what they do. You'll be amazed at, like, the call-outs and stuff like that. It's crazy. It's a whole other world. It's a world that I don't want to be a part of. Um, but it's a world that I'm glad is out there, you know, because there's people out there. There's a lot of people. I mean, those when I played this... Man, I wish I remember the exact number, but I'm going to say it was at least like 10,000, probably even more, people playing like just league play that night. Uh, it was 10,000 seems like a lot low, man. I don't even remember, but it, there was a, a large, 
abundance of people playing league play. And I was like, all right, man, well, good, good for y'all, man. Way, way to knock it out. Um, so it's definitely something that's going to be brought back in Ghost. Definitely something that needs to be there. You know, it's not my cup of tea. don't matter. Uh, so we're over here holding down this hard point, and I'm thinking, I'm like, oh, yeah, I'm holding down the hard point. It doesn't even exist anymore. Dang it. And I know that they're coming through the bar because if you look when I threw that hellstone right there, they all come from the bar. And it makes sense to come through the bar. It's the most protected place, so no problem. They're already set up over there uh, camping out that, that hard point. I'm like, all right, man, y'all got it. I'm out. Boom. Sentry gun managed to get a kill. I lay down. This guy walks into me. Thank you. Got the turn on my man. Woo. We ain't got no worries. And I see my man right here. No, 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 no. I cannot be allowing you to just be shooting everybody like that. We got to end that right there. And unfortunately, this guy out head glitches me on the same head glitch I was getting head glitching at. And then he comes over here. He almost popped me because I spawned. What a brutal spawn. I'm like, Jesus. Uh, the spawns are pretty crazy, too. Even with the four people, they still were nuts. Uh, which is something that really has to be fixed. And really something I don't think will be fixed in Ghosts. Uh, like... I think spawning done like these spawns are the best that we're gonna get, if not worse. There's gonna be bad spawns because the maps are gonna get smaller. Now I doubt that ghost maps are gonna be bigger. The days of CeeLo, the days of Array, the days of you know taking you a while to find the map, those days are gone. It's all about quick, intense gameplay that you can play. I was talking about esports in the previous video, I believe. Uh, it's all about that. It's all about that quick, intense gameplay you can bring on. It's easy. Um, to show something, you know, to a crowd when the map's the slum size. It's difficult when it's array size. You're like, well, he's over here, uh, you know, in the bottom floor of the array tower. Uh, and, you know, DJ Ski Master is playing on top of the uh, satellite dish uh, over yonder with the other... Nah, it just takes too much effort for that. They're going to keep making them smaller and smaller and smaller and smaller maps. At one point, I'm going to tell you what, man. I'm going to let you in on a secret. Inside a secret right here that I got. Um, from the new Call of Duty Ghost that's coming out. Inside a secret right here, trade model. Make sure you don't tell nobody. Don't tell your kids. Don't tell your wife. Don't 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 have a wife or kids just to tell them. Don't do that. I'm going to tell you a secret. In the next Call of Duty Ghost, they're going to have a map where when you spawn, you're looking automatically at the other team. It's going to be called Duel. And it's going to be the smallest map in history. You're not even going to be able to move. You're literally just going to be in a straight line. And it's whoever hits that trigger button faster, man. It's going to be crazy. That's insider information right there don't let anybody know that's a scoop that i got from some insider sources um and that's how it's gonna be but in all seriousness i mean the spawns that they're, they're just gonna get worse because maps are gonna get small no, no one's gonna be making big maps there'll be one or two big maps sure you know but turbine's about as big as a map you're gonna get that that's it and that's even pushing and even the spawns of turbine can be crazy over there and you hear the music coming up means it's a wrap i think i cut it off or something i didn't even like fully recall like the metal ending at the end but we did all right 33 and 15 not too too bad hope you all have a great month everybody